If you could see anyone get taken by a UFO. Oh, wow. <laughs> I cannot answer this. Let's say it's better than Earth. Is there anybody that, you know, it might be nice to, hey, go up there for a couple hours. I like A couple you. hours? Yeah, sure. Hi, I'm Michael Costa. The tennis tour is one of the most exciting places in the world, but the competition is fierce and the athletes can feel stressed and even alone. That's why we've created a comfortable place where they can unwind and get away from it all, for six to eight minutes at least. Welcome to Warm and Fuzzy. Come on in, this is your seat here. This is my seat here. Great. It's nice, right? Do you mind? Do, you, do I mind about the slippers? Yeah. They're there for you. Okay, great. So yeah. I mean, when was the last time you did I'm an interview? I'm also gonna take Oh my time. gosh, she's going all the way, ladies and gentlemen. I had a sour before coming here. It's all so. good, those are your slippers. That Does feels great, because I don't have, back in my hotel, I don't have slippers, so I'm gonna take them with me. I think that's important. Yeah. What strategies do you use to like chill out and calm down? Because I've watched you play a lot of tennis. And it's intense. Is it? Yes, it's great. Oh. I love that. But okay. I'm saying, how do you chill out when it's time to chill out? I wear my slippers. <laughs> that's, yeah. that's great. That's perfect. Check out this. Ball, please. Speaking of intense. Wow. And there's a question for you on here. You ready? Yep. If you didn't play tennis, what would you do? Oh, wow. So I would probably, you know, try track and field, maybe? Track and field? Yeah. I'm. I'm I'm a quick, quick You're quick. One. Yeah. I would never, if I ever played you, which yeah. will never happen. You would never drop shot. I would right? never drop shot you. I know. Many don't, don't, don't say that to other players, but they always do. They do that. Yeah. Maybe it's like a way for them to go, I want to see how fast she really is. Maybe. Did you get that? Yeah. You come from a long history of tennis. I mean, your mom yep. was a professional tennis player, but is it true that she said, I don't want my daughter to play tennis? Yeah, she did, um, because back in the day, I mean, tennis was tougher than it is now. It was tougher to travel, mm -hmm. it was tough to book your tickets, so she didn't want me to suffer, you know. Moms don't like sure. watching their kids suffer. So, yeah, she didn't want to, but, you know, it just happened. It happens. Yeah. And are you happy that you play tennis? Oh, yeah, I'm extremely happy. Yeah, it's really yeah. happy. Ball, please. Look at this. Another question. If you could see anyone get taken by a UFO. Oh, wow. <laughs> I cannot answer that question. I mean, let's say, let's say it's a wonderful UFO. Let's say it's better than Earth. Is there anybody that, you know, it might be nice to, hey, go up there for a couple hours. I like A couple you. hours? Yeah, sure. Then myself. Then yourself? Yeah. So you wouldn't mind being abducted by a UFO? No, just for a couple hours. Just for a couple hours. But then I would want to, you know, come back. <laughs> I think that's a perfectly fair answer. Here are some different feelings on the tennis ball. Grab one and tell me the last time you felt that. That? When was the last time you felt this that? This morning. Yeah, how come? I had a day off yesterday, so I was not feeling well. The ball was bouncing, it was, it was hot. Yeah. It wasn't ideal. So then I was kind of angry and I'm not feeling my shots. But then five minutes later, I started feeling good. So that was the last time so I did. You, so you had the day off. Yeah. The, oh, the, was... the strokes were clunky. Okay, got yeah. it. Let's do one more ball, please. You want to okay. you want to get the ball yes. directly? So you just say ball, please. Ball, please. And he'll run it to you. Thank you. This is a question for you to answer. Wow, secret talent. Yeah, what is a secret talent? You said there's lots of things you like to do. Hmm. Hmm. Um, secret talent. I have a very, very good memory. Like okay. an extremely good memory. I'll remember your socks and your shoes and what's written on your shoes and everything. Really? In a few years' time. If I see you in a few years, yeah. remember. Will you remember that I have my Eight, six, career oh. prize money winnings on my shoe? Yeah, I will. 11,190. I will. And will. I'll remember your, of course, your ranking. That's my highest ranking, yeah. 864. I'm gonna mark this down, somebody, in five years. I'm going to come to the next tournament you're in, and I'm going to say, do you remember my shoes, okay? Yeah, I will. I've really enjoyed talking to you, and I'll see you in five years. See you in five years. Okay, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> that was great. You're the best. Thank you. Can we do a quick photo on our slippers? Sure, yeah. Okay, Heath's going to take a photo for us. 